Imagination Celebration and Hello Kitty Island Adventure just started this week. When you first log into the game, there'll be a cutscene with Bats Mario and Pinchaco talking about how things seem just a little too quiet. And soon, Hello Kitty and My Melody show up in costume. They let us know that it's time for the Imagination Celebration and that we'll be collecting Mystic Stones. The Mystic Stones are the event currency that we'll be collecting throughout the event. As usual, they're scattered around Seaside Resort, and you can get them from four daily tasks each day. There'll be seven to collect around the resort, so you can get a total of 11 each day between picking them up on the island and doing the daily quests. As usual, we can exchange this event currency at the event stand for themed furniture. Be sure to bring Tuxedo Sam with you for a chance of getting duplicates. At the event stand, we'll be able to get the Royal Banner for 25, the Royal Bed for 30, the Brazier for 20, Royal Chair for 25, Stone Column for 10, Stone Sconce Column for 12, the Imagination Celebration Event Stand. This is a miniature version of the event stand for 25, the Floor for 20, the Stone Half Wall for 12, the long stone table for 25, stone block pedestal for 5, the mystic stone display for 15, and the wall for 20. As usual, there is a login bonus calendar, and it looks like all the event clothing is gonna be on these login bonus calendars. We have a part 1, which means that there will probably be a part 2 and a finale calendar like we've seen in the past. On the part 1, we have the princess dress, the princess hat, a wizard robe, and a second princess dress. The second one is the Hello Kitty princess princess dress. You'll notice with that gold background, we expect that we would not be able to dye it. However, the regular princess dress and probably the other clothing that we see on here with that purple background, we can dye. So if you bring your princess dress over to the dye station at Tuxedo Sam shop, we have seven different colors to choose from. As of right now, we don't know if we'll end up getting multiples of these like we have with some of the other clothing items in the past, or if it'll just be this one that you dye into whatever color you want. It looks like the same same thing will happen with the wizard robe and with the princess hat. If we look at the collection for the event, we have 14 different furniture items. Now we saw 13 of these at the event stand, so it looks very likely that we'll have to get that double bed from the dessert boat again, which means you'll have to plan on getting two of the regular beds from the event stand. So if you did get one of everything and two of that single bed so you can turn one into the double bed and finish your collection, you are going to need 270 four stones. That's gonna take you 25 days if you get all 11 every day, picking up all seven on the ground, and completing all four of your daily tasks. If you only pick up the ones on the ground and you don't do your daily quests, it would actually take you 40 days. We don't know for sure if this is the entire span of the event, but that would be doing this every day for almost six weeks. Only two days of buffer. We also see all of the clothing that we see on the calendar right now, but we see the additional night outfit that we can see in the promo image, and a wizard hat, and we see that there are four dresses and four hats. So far we can see two of the dresses, so we have the base dress, the Hello Kitty dress, we have the base hat, and presumably we'll have a Hello Kitty hat, and then the the other two are most likely going to be My Melody and Karomi themed. We see both of them in costume in the promo images, and on day two we get a cutscene that includes Karomi in costume. Though we have these cutscenes to add a little bit more to the event, and in the event trailer we saw a little bit more with Hello Kitty spinning around with one of the mystic stones and some magic looking swirls. The characters don't stay in costume for the duration of the event, so far it's only been during these cutscenes. And for the first time, the furniture from the event is also customizable, so you'll be able to bring it over to my sweet piano and change the color. So hopefully this helps you with the imagination celebration and Hello Kitty Island adventure. If it did, consider giving the video a like so others can find it as well. Subscribe for more Hello Kitty Island adventure content and turn on notifications to find out the next time we go live. Hope to see you there.